हेलो स्टूडेंट्स टुडे वी आर गोइंग टू राइट स्टैंडर्ड फिफ्थ सब्जेक्ट साइंस लेसन नंबर थ्री द अर्थ एंड इट्स लिविंग वर्ल्ड फुल वर्कबुक क्वेश्चन आंसर्स क्वेश्चन नंबर वन फिलिंग द ब्लैंक्स द डैश एक्सटेंड्स अंडर द वाटर आल्सो आंसर लिथोस्फीयर सेकेंड रील्स आर द स्मॉलेस्ट एंड Rivers are the biggest freshwater sources. Third one, huge blocks of ice floating in the sea are called icebergs. Fourth one, almost all the water vapor in the atmosphere is contained in the troposphere. Fifth one, the layer of the atmosphere which is next to the troposphere is called stratosphere sixth one many lakes and wells get water from springs seventh one kangaroos are found only in australia now question number 2 write whether the following statements are true or false first one the sun is not the cause of many natural processes on the earth answer is false second one we see rocks spilled apart by the tree roots true third one reels brooks and stream join each other to form ocean false fourth one the huge mass of ice slipping down on the slopes from glacier true fifth one one can see elephants and lions only in the polar regions falls sixth one a water body formed by water collecting naturally is called a lake true next question question number 3 in the following sentences underline the word the refer to landforms anil lives at the foot of hill hill second one riya lives in a plateau region plateau third one we can see many valley near lunavla answer valley fourth one mount everest is a situated in the himalayan mountain ranges mountain fifth one ratan can easily climb the hill of saptashringi answer hill question number 4 give any two examples of each first one weather related events cloud formation rain fog winds storms second one sources of water reels brook stream river waterfall lake and pond next question name the following first one five oceans atlantic ocean pacific ocean arctic ocean Indian Ocean and Southern Ocean. Second one, seven continents. First one, Europe. Second, Africa. Third one, South America. Fourth one, North America. Fifth one, Antarctica. Sixth one, Asia. It's the largest continent. Seventh one, Australia. It's the smallest continent. next coastal water bodies sea bay strait gulf and creek next question number 6 answer the following questions in one sentence each first one write the names of the envelopes of the earth answer is the envelopes of air around the earth is called atmosphere troposphere stratosphere mesosphere ionosphere and exosphere second one what is a continent how many continents are there on the earth answer is a continent is a vast continuous stretch of land there are seven continent on the earth question number 3 what is a glacier 
आंसर इज अ ह्यूज मास ऑफ आईस दैट स्लिप्स ग्रेजुअली ओवर स्लो एट अ वेरी स्लो स्पीड इज कॉल्ड ग्लेशियर फोर्थ वन वॉट मेक्स द हाइड्रोस्फियर ऑफ द अर्थ आंसर इज द वॉटर और आइस दैट ऑक्युपाइज द अर्थ सरफेस ग्राउंड वॉटर एंड वॉटर वेपर इन द एटमोसफियर टूगेदर फ्रॉम द अर्थ हाइड्रोस्फियर फिफ्थ वन विच आर द मेन कॉन्स्टिट्यूंट्स ऑफ द एटमोसफियर आंसर इज नाइट्रोजन ऑक्सीजन कार्बन डाइऑक्साइड वॉटर वेपर गैसेस इन स्मॉल क्वांटिटीज एंड डस्ट पार्टिकल्स आर द मेन कॉन्स्टिट्यूंट्स ऑफ द एटमोसफियर नेक्स्ट क्वेश्चन सिक्स वन हाउ डज ओजोन गैस प्रोटेक्ट लिविंग बींग्स आंसर इज द ओजोन गैस प्रेजेंट इन द स्ट्रेटोस्फियर एब्जॉर्ब द हार्मफुल अल्ट्रावायलेट रेज present in sunlight due to which living beings are protected from those radiation next question number 7 answer the following questions first one what are cloud made up of answer is clouds are made up of fine droplets of water the sun heat evaporates the water to form vapor from the earth surface this water vapor rises high up in the atmosphere at cool heights it's condenses forming droplets of water which turn into the clouds second one what is meant by biosphere living things are seen in all the envelope of the earth such as lithosphere hydrosphere and atmosphere all living things in these three envelopes form a biosphere plants animals and microorganisms together make a biosphere question 3 where do all the weather related phenomena take place answer all weather related phenomena such as the cloud formation rain fog winds and storms occur in the troposphere next question why have special arrangements to be made to ensure that passengers in an aeroplane get enough air for breathing answer is aeroplane fly at the high level of the troposphere here the air is rare there can be less oxygen present which is necessary for breathing therefore passengers who are in a aeroplane need some arrangement to ensure that they get enough air for breathing next use your brain power fifth one in which layer of the atmosphere do we see the rainbow answer we see rainbow in the layer of atmosphere sixth one mountaineers carry oxygen in cylinders when they climb mountains that are the more than 5000 meter high what could be the reason for that answer is as we climb up the height the air at the top becomes rare at the height of 5000 meter or more the air is very rare the oxygen may be limited here therefore mountaineers carry oxygen in cylinders when they climb high mountain next use your brain power seventh one why are the microorganism important answer is the microorganisms perform important function of the degradation they also occupy important place in the food chain the matter is decaying into soil minerals by microorganisms question number 8 write short note on evaporation answer the heat changes water into vapor this action is called evaporation the sun's heat converts the water present on the earth surface 
into water vapor all such vapor enters the atmosphere this vapor condenses and comes in the form of rain back to the surface of the earth thus evaporation is necessary of rainfall next condensation the process of vapor turning into water on cooling is called condensation the water vapor reaches the upper layers of atmosphere get condensed and forms fine droplets of water third one water cycle answer due to the sun heat the water on the earth surface is continuous evaporated since the water vapor is lighter than air it rises heights is the atmosphere due to cool temperature at the height the water vapor condenses forming fine droplets of water small droplet of water become heavier and bigger they falling on earth form of rain or snow and mix in all water bodies in this way water moves in cycle manner which is known as a water cycle next open ended questions what is the solution first one dark patches appear on the skin after exposure to the sun answer is the harmful radiation of the sun can cause a burning sensation to our skin use umbrella cap or sun coat in sunlight wear cotton clothes use the sunscreen cream is advisable covering the face with handkerchief can protect the delicate skin second one make a list of landforms you see in your surroundings and give description of any two of them answer in my surroundings there is a small hillock and playground i can see mountain ranges at a far distance first one hillock hillock is a small size mountain the land on the hillock is sloping it is easy to climb a hillock we can plant trees on the slope of hill second one playground playground is a plain flat part of the land there is no slope we can plant tree here also next is the activity draw a label diagram showing water cycle you have to draw a diagram here a water cycle diagram sun set evaporation of water from the earth stream river sea and earth water vapor is mixed with air then condensation of water vapor then fine particles of water formation of clouds heavy particles of water then rain and again evaporation of water from the earth here our lesson number 3 question answers is completed i hope you understand all the question answers thank you